How you going? This week it's just a vlog folks because I've been up to here with organisation stuff. So what's been happening? Well uh, for starters, this guy had his first trip in a boat last night with me and uh, didn't go too flash, did it mate? Hey? He uh, had a big feed of possum before I took him out and he got a bit seasick and uh, we ended up creating a bit more birdie than we expected. Also, we've had some amazing developments on the YouTube site. Some people, some very good people, I'm going to call them good bastards, have put their hands in their pockets and done this. Anyway, I'm back here in the studio. I've just got this email from this guy and I haven't even looked at it yet. I'd, I think he's probably winding me up, but uh, he's ordered uh, he's ordered a couple of CDs. Uh, it seems like quite a good bastard though, because he's going to send me some flies for fishing over. His name is, is Darren. He's over in Aussie. Oh, they can't all be too bad. Anyway, uh, he goes, uh, I had to read this too, because he goes, um, P.S. Uh, check out your PayPal account. I think a drone is on its way, mate. So he's probably winding me up, but I don't think he has. <laughs> so we're just logging in here now. Oh, fuck me. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm just um, <laughs> composing myself, people. Woo! So, this is a really, uh, I can't get the grin off my face. <laughs> oh, man, I feel like I've just had a shot of something, you know. Um, it's gonna be really cool to see what we can do. Man, you shouldn't have done that, dude, but honestly, Darren, and he's an Aussie. Anyway, uh, someone said to me a while ago, you know, one day, someone who's got a lot of money is gonna give you some money so you can buy a drone. And I said, there won't be someone with a lot of money, mate. I said, people that have got a lot of money, you know, millionaires, they don't, they don't give that sort of money away. That's how they become millionaires. The people that give have often got very little in their lives. And that's why they're so generous, and so that's what makes them so amazing. You know, there's a bit of a pattern going on here, because the last person that sent me a really good gift was that nice knife, and he was also from Australia. And I think this guy here is uh, in Australia too, so... Um, Let's get it on! Another good pass just into the club. Now, Ryan, KFC, one of my subscribers, reckons he can get us a drone, which is what we are aiming to get for under this price here. That's NZ. Right now we're at 1150. And I've got a message today saying that another $35 has come in. So we're now at 1185. I think that's right, but anyway, we're trying to get to this number. But this guy over here, KFC, he reckons he can get one for 18. I think it's six, one, six, one plus GST. Now the drone we want to get is a Mavic. These things are bloody awesome. So uh, going back to the Good Bastards Club, these are just a fraction of the Good Bastards. I've only just started writing it now. Um, you know if you're a Good Bastard, your name will show up on there. If you think you're a Good Bastard and your name's not on there um, in the future, because we're coming back to this, let me know. There's a whole lot more names I've got to get put on it. So this week, of course, I've only got a vlog because I'm going away and I've had a lot of preparation work before I've gone away. This is all my gear on the table here, just getting it sorted. Being a YouTuber, of course, I've got cameras, electronic shit that you normally don't take when you go hunting because I am filming it so you guys can watch it. The rifle I'm using is my 243. I've only blooded it on one deer so far, but did the bizzo okay. Suppressed. When you're out in the scrub this year during the raw, take care because man, we've got an atrocious record in New Zealand. So many people every year get killed, and it's, it's fucking scary. I'm going away with blokes I trust, and that's one of the reasons I haven't gone away a lot in the past over the raw because I've actually been fearful that I'm going to get shot because mates end up shooting mates, and it's, it's horrible. You know, treat every firearm as if it's loaded. Never point the muzzle at anything that you don't intend to destroy. Um, 
what else are some of the basic rules? Well, you really have to assume that everything in the bush is human until 100% proven otherwise. Because the brain, it can, play, it can play tricks on you. You know, I've had it myself where I've thought, oh, there's a pig over there, and it's turned out to be a piece of bark or something. So just stop before you take the shot and go through that checklist in your mind. Don't shoot at colour, don't shoot at sound, don't shoot at anything until you're 100% sure it is what you really think it is. But enjoy the process too. Right, enough of the uh, safety uh, yarn. What else has been happening? Well, it's been a bit of a hard week. My boat, I've been working on. After a week of putting caulking in it, uh, that means that's between the gaps. Primer, putty, top coat, anti-fouling. I launched it back in the water. And what did it do? Started taking on water. You can't go wrong, they said. You haven't tied up a lot of money in it, it'll be sweet. Finally thought I had it fixed. Stuck in the water yesterday, what happened? She started to sink, taking on shitloads of water. Which take her out, then what happened? Gearbox shit itself. She started drifting down the channel. So we went, fuck it. I know what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get one of those big bastards. That's exactly what I did. Big crane. Now she's there. That's exactly where she's gonna stay. Norma Jean. Goodbye, Norma Jean. You can spend the rest of your life living on a section. So I'm not fucking working on it anymore. I'm done. Happy days. Freedom! Freedom! There's my truck. Well, old Bruno's making a racket out in his box because Poe's on heat, locked up in the back of my truck, and he's trying to work out how we can get to her. And he's going, oh! He sounds between a dog, a seal barking, and a stag roaring, making a hell of a noise. He's bugling away there. That rounds up this vlog. Anyway, a massive thank you to everybody so far who has contributed to this drone. It's just awesome. I'm blown away. If you want to contribute to it, in the description box below, I'll put my email address, Dame on it, super child, blah, blah, blah. You can PayPal through that. You can work it out. And uh, we will get a drone in the air. That'll be awesome. Just imagine flying over, like, you know, a school of kawaii or a river full of trout or zoning in on a stag, locking in on it and following it. Or the dogs, you know, because this thing, you can zone in on something and follow it. Imagine we spot the ball and we zone in on that, set the, the good bastard. That's what the drone's going to be called. It's going to be called the good bastard. We're going to set the good bastard up in the sky and it just, like, follows it. It'll be, it'll be amazing. It'll be awesome. Yeah, that's it from me. Be good. If you can't be good, you know, be careful. We'll see you soon.